You want to be a cool stocking stuffer? Oh yeah. What's the latest? What's the coolest? We only have to go like 2,500 miles away to talk to the man, the guru. When it comes to video games, it might be just the right price to put in a stocking. Let's find out what's hip and cool. Scott, welcome all the way from Seattle. Hey, Con, how are you? <laughs> Scott, I am doing great. We are so close to unwrapping gifts, it's ridiculous. Yes, we are right there with you. And let me tell you, I'm almost as excited as my kid is, so uh, I, I feel your pain. Well, there's no doubt about it, Scott. You always have some great ideas for us. Now it's time for show and tell. And somehow, you're going to play into the mix Jurassic Park, Sword Fighting, and ABBA? Cheers. Well, right off the bat, like you were saying, Jurassic Park, the game, if you're looking for a stocking stuffer, that's a good option. We'll explain how it relates to ABBA shortly enough. But this is a cinematic adventure game, also has fast-paced action, set during the first movie, not just familiar locations and dinosaurs, but all new terrifying prehistoric creatures and areas to explore. Really cool. You can get it on the Xbox 360 at stores. You can also download it right to your computer, your PS3, or your iPad. So good stocking stuff for right there. You might also, like you were saying, try ABBA. You can dance. So if you happen to be having a holiday party and you want a stocking stuffer that will please everyone in the family, if you're going retro, 70s, 80s, this one invites up to four players to unleash their inner dancing queen on the dance floor or even sing along with tracks like Mamma Mia or, of course, uh, t tracks like uh, Take a Chance on Me. So if you happen to be a fan of the musical sensation, good option. And actually, it's got uh, concert footage, music videos, photos, so that's cool, too. But if you're looking for a mobile game that you want to play on your iPhone, your iPad, your iPod Touch, another great stocking stuffer would be Infinity Blade 2. Everyone talking about this one. Got to see the graphics to believe it. 3D looks like something that should be on your TV, but it plays on your iOS device. Super fun sword fighting battles, appropriate for ages 9 and up, and cost just $6.99, so hard to complain about that. Great idea, Scott. What else do you have? All right, well, some other great options. You might try something like the UDraw game tablet. You and I have talked about it before. It's great for family game night. Now more affordable, so it's under 50 bucks. You just sketch and draw, and it appears on screen, turns any TV into an art studio. Nice part. You can save your creations, print them out, share them online. Also plays original games, things like SpongeBob Squiggle Pants or Disney Princess Enchanting Storybook, so that's a good option. Of course, if you do have an iPhone or iPad waiting under the tree, you can also download games like Tiny Places on Demand. Reason I suggest this, it's a physics-based platform puzzle game. Anyone can play it, easy to pick up, hard to put down, tougher to master. Stars a chameleon named Napoleon. He's really adorable, and he's got this sticky elastic tongue. You use it to flick him, send him flying around screen, escape from tight spots. So that's another great option as well. You know, Scott, one thing about video games is that so many people think that you, you just play by yourself in solitude, but it could potentially bring a family together to play together. That's right, that's right. And actually delve deeper into it about how young, old, everybody's playing. It's better for families. In a new book I've got, it's called The Modern Parents Guide to Kids and Video Games. That's going to be a free download in the new year at parentsguidebooks.com. First in the world's first high-tech parenting series about social networks, apps, and other things. So definitely video games, technology can please all ages. Scott, we are so glad we got to connect with you right before the end of the year to give us some great ideas, particularly for our stockings. Thank you. Thanks, Con. Happy holidays. I should have said happy gaming. Man, everyone's playing games. You guys are probably at home watching the TV playing a game to the side, but we probably have you distracted because the show is so interesting. At any rate, we'll be back with more Get Connected. Thank you so much for watching. Are you tired of negative news? We are. And that's why we're creating a movement. By keeping it real. With what you need to know. It's more than what's happening. It's bringing hope back to our lives. So go to contv.com and join our movement. <laughs>